the Hyde Novices Hurdle is race four. Uh, this is a two mile and five furlong Novice Hurdle. And at the top we've got a Devil in the Pool for Darren Thompson, who was a winner last time out. Wayward Cats for Leon Van Rensburg has already gone in twice this season. Aerial along for Darren Thompson, Carson's Rocket, Paul Rhodes, King of the Kingdom, Joshua sort of Native Tong, Obi Wan, Starlight David Hooley, and Ozark Fizz for Vinnie Gerard. So eight of them this time. You could argue it's maybe between the top two, but there's plenty down the bottom with form, and away they go. And Native Tongue is just about the first to show from Carson's Rocket. And then Devil in the Pool as they make their way to the first of the eleven flights that they've got to take in this two mile five furlong novice hurdle. Mr. the one great in this. That's Carson's. Rocket, I believe. And it's Native Tongue, who is the current leader. So Native Tongue is in the lead. The rest of them are virtually all in a line with widest on the track. Ozark Fizz in the two shades of green for Vinnie Gerard. Darren Thompson has got two in this. Here along and Devil in the pool. They get to the second. They're all safely over the second with Native Tongue, the clear leader. Aerial along in second, and then Wayward Cats is in third. And towards the back, Starlight is just the back marker at this point. And they're racing down to the two mile point. Already then, a native tongue racing downhill leads by two lengths. To Aerial along in second, and then Wayward Cats is in third. King of the Kingdom is fourth, and Devil in the Pool is fifth. So they get to the third, which they're all safely over. And then Starlight. And Carson's Rocket, the back two at the moment. Okay, Native Tongues lead down to just about a length or so now. From King of the Kingdom on the outside, is moved through into second, then Aerial along and Wayward Cats as they get over the fourth. Begin to make their way into the straight. Well, if we're on the course, I think then they should take two flights of hurdles and then go out. For a complete circuit. Given the choice, I normally pick the wrong one. There's probably only one flight to take. Anyway, we'll soon see. They go with a fifth. And native tongue is clear. By about three lengths. And they do indeed start to swing left handed now. So just one in the straight on this course. And the native tongue racing uphill then. With a lead, a good four or five lengths now to Ozark Fizz, who's moved through into second. Devil in the pool on the outside is third. Stable mate Ariel along is in fourth. And on the inside of that one is Wayward Cats. Carson's Rockets making a bit of a forward move, and also around the outside there, King of the Kingdom, with Starlight just the back marker and um, rolling around a little bit, trying to figure out which is the best route to take. I think he's going to try and get a split in between. Wayward Cats and Carson's Rocket, they're all over the 6th and making their way towards the 7th. With Native Tongue clear by 2 to Ozark Fizz in 2nd and Devil in the Pool is in 3rd. Then comes Ariel along and then King of the Kingdom with Wayward Cats and Carson's Rocket. And then finally Starlight is the back marker of the 8 of them at this point. And they get over the 7th. All safely over that one with Native Tongue still commanding a lead of two lengths from Ariel along who's now just about showing second as we see them from the opposite side of the trap then now they've got four flights to take a native tongue has been pushed along by the jockey to keep the pace up Ozark Fizz looks to be going well in second then Ariel along as they get over the fourth from home the grey Carson's rocket is now coming around the outside and looks to be a big danger it's Native Tongue, Carson's Rocket is now second, Devil in the Pool, Aerial along, then King of the Kingdom, Ozark Fizz, and Wayward Cat Starlight is being pulled very wide on the track to come through to make a challenge, giving a little bit of ground away on the turns, but appears to be making ground on the leaders. And those leaders are Native Tongue and Carson's Rocket, King of the Kingdom, just showing third as they get to the third last. And Carson's Rocket into the front then there. Carson's Rocket from Native Kingdom in second, suddenly comes under a bit of pressure. Ozark Fizz is in third, coming round the outside. Wayward Cats looks to be going 
really well. One or two of them just caught a bit flat footed there as Carson's Rocket speeds over the second last. And it's Carson's Rocket now joined by Ozark Fizz. These two are too clear of Native Tongue who's sticking on. Then Wayward Cats, King of the Kingdom, airing along. Devil in the pool's got work to do. Starlight's making good ground around the outside. But it's Carson's Rocket, just the one flight to take and only a furlong to race. And now Wayward Cats comes through on the outside. And Wayward Cats hits the front. Wayward Cats in. He's going on now over the final flight. Quickly gone three or four clear. Airing along's jumped into second, was boxed in moment. Terribly, but this is Wayward Cats all the way. Wayward Cats takes it on the area long second. Starlight third, Devil in the Pool, Carson's Rocket, those up for his King of the Kingdom, and then Native Tongue. So, a relatively short straight with just the one flight, and Wayward Cats put that bed to race to bed pretty quickly once he got to the front. Talking about a good three lengths. Aaron along was a little bit unlucky, he was boxed in coming through to the final flight, but I don't think it would have made that much difference. Wayward Cats rated a good £45 superior to Aaron along. So Wayward Cats takes it then for Leon Van Rensburg. Aerial along for Darren Thompson was second. Starlight for David Hooley third. Devil in the Pool for Darren Thompson fourth. And Carson's Rocket for Paul Rhodes was fifth.